All right, the stream is live. I mean it. Anyone want a peanut? Peanut. <laughs> How good is that? Oh my god, amazing! <laughs> As he puts it down. <laughs> hi, hi, everybody. I am Jerry Stellenberg, founder of Multimorphic, and we are incredibly honored to present to you the Princess Bride pinball game for the P3 pinball platform. For those who don't know, the P3 is it's everything that's great about pinball. Real balls, still flippers, bumpers, targets, ramps, loops, toys, magnets, all the things that are great about pinball, plus two major enhancements. One, the machine is modular in the sense that we can put in new game kits. We can swap them in. The Princess Bride is our latest game kit, and it's the eighth available for the system. The second enhancement is we replaced the lower play field, which is traditionally a boring painted piece of wood. We replaced it with a dynamic and interactive display. And that allows us to put dynamic content underneath the ball as you're playing and immerse you into the story of the game. Because as we all know, The Princess Bride is an incredible story and we can immerse you in that experience. When we set out to design this game, we had two goals. One was to deliver an incredible playing experience for all pinball lovers and the second was to do justice to this incredible property the princess bride is an amazing film and we had to create an amazing game for it and some business the princess bride went on sale earlier this week it's available on multimorphic.com you can purchase the system the entire p3 in standard limited or collector's edition form for this game and existing P3 owners can purchase the Princess Bride Playfield module as a game kit in standard or limited edition. We go into production this summer, a few months away. And in those next few months, we have a bit more work to do on software. It is already mode complete. It's feature complete. All the rules are in place. We have a little bit of polishing to do. I'll fix a few bugs, take care of some visual issues, some audio issues. But and what you're going to see today is an almost complete game, and we're really excited to show it off for you. So I want to introduce everyone who's here with me. We have, of course, Kevin Manny, who's hosting the stream. Hey, Kevin. Brad Ramey, otherwise known as Pluto, is a partner manager at Twitch. He happens to live down the street and loves pinball, so he's the perfect person to join us. And we're also joined by Steven Silver, the creative director on this game, and TJ Weaver, who's the mechanical engineer on this game. So I'll stop talking there. We'll jump into some gameplay. We'll queue up a couple players, and we'll talk you through the game. Please ask questions in the chat, and we'll, uh, we'll be talking through and happy to answer them as we go. All right, let's go. All right. Kevin, go ahead and get us started. All right, you want me to kick it off solo here? Do it. All right. What's up, everybody? Hey, everybody. Chapter one. Steven's gonna describe what I'm what I'm doing as I play. I've only played this a few times, but I'm starting to get the hang of it. I don't mean to as he, you don't you know, have to first shot. Have six fingers That's right. on your right hand. I got emitted ball saves. Um, basically, the the way the game is uh, set up is that we've got uh, three different regions in the and game: no Thorn, Gilder, and Castle. Scream. And that's how you get to the modes. And so you get into the modes. Uh, you, you know just what that the sound is? Yeah, eels. yeah, shrieking eels. And Those porn. are the shrieking eels. If you don't believe me, just wait. They always grow louder when they're about to feed on human flesh. <laughs> All right, so what's the goal of this mode? All right, you are trying to swim away from the eels. So hit the swimming shot, you can swim away. Every time you hit a swimming shot, you can add a little bit more time to your mode. So, let's take it down. So the pressure starts building. Ah, oh, there you go. Uh, the surface is uh, some leg sand on top of the screen. So we've uh, got the screen protected, don't worry. Oh, she's gonna get eaten by the eels. Oh, oh you! <laughs> I failed. 
Where is that mode, but it's okay. Like you've, uh, you've tried it, so it, it's got new progress towards the mini wizard. What princess is really quite a winning creature. All right, so you're back in, and. Uh, Oh, you want to see marriage, right? Yeah. Yeah, here we go. Let's do marriage. Yeah, so he started castle mode, so he's going to start marriage. My Wesley will save me. <laughs> so all the, all the mode intros can either play fully, or you can cancel them, so you can get straight into gameplay. You don't have to watch the, the, the mode introduction every time. But we figured everybody was going to want to see him here. So, I mean, the first time. I assume nobody would ever skip my work. That's okay. <laughs> All right. So the uh, the object here is that you're you're hitting these shots. Buttercup and Humpy Dink are moving further and further apart across the playfield as you're hitting these shots, and their my values are getting higher and higher. So I was asking to see the back portion of the playfield. The overhead camera is, is set up to give you the, the overhead the action. If you look at the other camera, the one above the back box, you can see the, the depth of the playfield. Look, look up over there to see the back of the, camp, the playfield. It's mostly focused on the cliffs, which I'll try to show off this next, this next ball. Because that's a really cool match. Right. You have six fingers on the right hand. Someone was looking for you. In chat, we have Jay Coog, who's Josh Kugler, who's the lead software developer for the game. So, Jerry, we uh, we got some license. We, we did licensing for the game, but we also way. got licensing for some of the songs, too, to get um, actual tracks, right? That's right. There's six main tracks from the I film do not that we licensed. They, they are slightly rearranged, recomposed with some different energy for use in pinball, but um, those are licensed from Mark Knopfler, who was the original composer. Of the you have six fingers in your right hand. And then Someone we went was looking and worked for with Paul Fair, who's a brilliant composer. He integrated all six of those songs into various modes and enhanced it by how many more? Oh. There, there's got to be over 20 different music tracks. Oh, there's a ton of music here. It was amazing, amazing work. Uh, Mr. Stanley's in chat, too. Uh, that is Colin McAlpine, who did the rules in this game. So if anybody has any specific rules questions, feel free to poke come. him. How can you be sure? Oh, Jerry's got to lean in. That's we can't true. hear him. All right, I will lean Sounds farther into the day. mic. Hey, Ryan, how you doing? Yeah. So this is uh, True Love Multiball? True Love Multiball. So the, the objective in True Love Multiball, you got to first finish spelling True Love by hitting jackpot. So you, you start off with spot, True Spotted, so you got to spell four jackpots. you got to finish with four jackpots to get through and spell Love. So he's about halfway through his objective here. He's got one more left. Ah! And ripped it! Ha <laughs> you fool! Uh, somebody asked earlier how we would attach the the front art. There will be a uh, front art kit that'll be available uh, for older P3s. That's a, a metal plate that'll go out that you can, that'll be available for purchase. You want to do this one with me? Sure. All right, it's going to be me and Pluto. You guys know Pluto. You can, do, you can be player one. Princess Bride by S. Morgenstern, chapter one. You said you were trying to show off the Cliffs of Insanity. Yeah, so yeah, I, yeah. I got I to gotta try my hardest as well. Mm, it's sure Ooh, it's it's strong it's really enough good. to go up our way. Mm -hmm. there we go. Look, he's right on top of us. Whoever he is, he's too late. See? Such a the cliffs of insanity. Hurry up. No, all the front Move art comes the with the LA kit. If you buy the LA kit, you get the entire art package, to clarify. But if you, uh, if, um, if you... Did I make it clear yeah, the P3 that is unique in the sense that existing oh, owners of the platform can add new games. So earlier models of the P3 didn't the have rope. front artwork. And People who buy it for this game, oh. who buy it now, it'll come with everything. All the artwork pieces, the front piece, the side pieces, there are uh, slingshot covers, side target covers, there's the apron magnet, the speaker panel. 
there is a lot of artwork that comes with this game. The Prince's Bride by S. Morgenstern. You started it. It's, a, it's all about it, really. <laughs> So you always start every ball in what we call the map scene, because you can see the map of the land. Uh, there's a skill shot sequence on the center ramp that Kevin hit one shot for. Now it's timed out. Um, he's controlling the ball to Only is try to, to hit way. one region and start a mode. The, the, it's called the farm boy sequence. So if you make enough of the farm boy sequences, you're working your way to as you wish awards, and we'll get into that later. All right, so he just shot the cliffs. The ball is literally sitting on the cliffs, ready to climb up. You can see it in the play field shot, or you will as soon as he starts hitting shots. You'll see it start climbing up the physical cliff surface. This is a climbing mode, so you want to hit the rising shots, the ramp shots. The center ramp's easy, but the left ramp, you get double scoring on the left ramp. He did it! Show me yeah, we, we intentionally put the climbing shots yeah, yeah, yeah. on some of the on the center ramp because it's easier to hit. We want people to experience the cliffs. We want them to get through it, and we want them to have a chance to play all these cool battles. All right, I'm gonna show out the battle of steel. Battle of steel. Uh, we're gonna do it single ball though. Single ball right now. You seem yeah. a decent fellow. I hate to kill you. You seem a decent fellow. I hate to die. Back in. So like the movie, I'm playing one-handed. So I'm playing with my left hand to begin, and then I'm going to switch to my right if I make it far. You're using Bonetti's defense against That's me. That's one of the things we can do with P3. Oh! Uh, ball save. I'm good. Yeah, ball save. I can not bear it if you died again. Not when yeah. I could save you. So on the screen right now, underneath the left flipper is a note reminding the player that they're using the left buttons. Uh. I need left ramp now, right? Yeah, that's your last shot. Yeah, there's a shot marker in the upper left corner of the screen saying, shoot it here. I'm mostly trying to split the right flippers. Earlier I made it to where I was able to switch it. That is one of the coolest, like, theme integrations I think I've ever, yeah, I've ever seen. That's so cool. So after you do it left, you said you switch to the right? Yeah, once yeah. you get like halfway through like, the like, oh, that's my secret. Like, yeah. Yes, I'm also right now. Yeah, okay, okay. Got it. That's really cool. All right, let's see what we can do. Farm boy, polish my horse's saddle. Ball set. I promise no harm will come to you. I cannot make the promise. But you don't by any chance happen to have six fingers on your right hand. To everybody tuning in, this is the Princess Pride pinball machine on the Multimorphic P3 pinball platform. Humiliations go. Kevin, someone's asking for a better player to show off the game. Wow. <laughs> well, that means that, we got to have... That's to me, not We, you, we have to have Stephen play, obviously. Yes, yes. We're, we're holding back the, uh, the ringer. <laughs> oh, we got the ringer coming next. Yeah. All right, here we go. That was probably a tag, if I had to guess. Farm boy. I love Wesley. I yeah, a little have. bit later in the stream, we'll slow it down and talk more about the rules in, in, in a in a more controlled environment. But now we just want to experience the game, let you all see how it's implemented, see the, the theme emergence, see the video Is playing on the screen, and nearby? enjoy the voice call outs and stuff. We did shrieky eels already, so let's do... Yeah, like Guide my sword. I have failed you for 20 years. Now our misery can end. Somewhere, somewhere close by is a man who can help us. I cannot find him alone. I need you. I need you to guide my sword. Please. Let's see if I can do this. So Kevin is literally trying to guide the sword by shooting the scoop that opens up when the sword is pointed at it. And if the sword isn't pointing at it like it is now, he needs to shoot the left side targets to move the scoop or oh, to move the sword to the left. Oh, he went 
So he hit the right side target, moved it farther to the right. There you go, back to the left one, and he needs to hit it one more time to the left side. There you go. Oh, but it, but, but it caromed into the right side. Almost, you hit the post. All right, yeah. so now the wall came down, the scoop open, he can shoot it. Now he's got to do it one more time. This time he's got to move it to the right twice. Not on the tree. Yeah, it's all right. It's very... really I failed my father too, up. Kevin. <laughs> uh, let's do Buttercup's Nightmare. My father's final words were, This one's a fun one to stack a multi-ball on. Love her as I loved her. And oh, this is the Noel Flipper joy. one. I present to you your queen. Queen Buttercup. So this one's Buttercup's Nightmare. It's a two-ball multi-ball where the flippers have no hold feature on them. So all they do is flip real fast. So you can't just cradle the ball and hold on to it. And your goal is to survive the nightmare. So you literally just have to keep the balls in play for the duration of the mode time. Easier said than done. Much easier said than done. As soon as he drains down to one ball, the mode will end. All right, we got true love going here. Let's go. Steven said this I should stack this one. very discordant multi-ball stack right now. <laughs> she, she's, in her, she's in her nightmare and experiencing a true love. Oh, the fit of the first ball fight. So you succeeded because you were in multi-ball and had more balls to keep you alive. Good job, Kevin. That's a good strategy. I totally planned that. Good strat. <laughs> All right. Okay, so this is, uh, he's made it to stage two of True, true Love Multiball, which is where you've got to set up the kiss shot. So he sits, he has to hit the right orbit or the right side loop to set up the lock. So if he does that, now it's locked in that orbit, so now he has to make the balls kiss. At that, uh, Why does he have to make the balls kiss, Steven? Because this is a kissing book, and that's what you got to do. It's a kissing book. It's a kissing book. Oh, kissing I hit it not good enough. He did. Oh, did I? Okay, I uh, did it. Not in time. Ah, oh, boo. He didn't do it in time. Form a fruit squad, then. I want the thief's forest so, empty. So now when I drain, I'll I have the uh, pit of despair waiting for me. Let's see. I can't find it. Your way! Oh. I just, I just wanted to show that off. Sure right, here goes Pit of Despair. So this is a ball saver mode Present that kicks in if you once you've earned Pit of Despair. So I want you to be totally um, it's an add a ball mode to where you sleep. have to get through and survive the Pit of Despair without draining a single ball. If you can do that, uh, you can continue on. If not, uh, you cannot. Ow. Boo. Boo this man. To where you were, Could everybody in chat please boo this man? <laughs> oh, they will. they will. Yeah, they will. <laughs> there we go. Thank you, Rabbit Pie. There we All go. Right. Yes, bring the booze. There we go. Yes, that's what I want to see. I want to see 10,000 booze. There we go. <laughs> Farm boy, polish my horse's saddle. As you wish. All right, so he did completed his farm boy one, so he got an as you wish. Well, actually, he already earned his as you wish, so he 
you can go. We've got three levels of uh, yes, as you wish that you can. Uh, that three you. levels of Farm Boy you can go through. So if you complete the super sequence, it's really good. Go away! I believe that's the technical term is really good. That's what we decided on in, in the, all these meetings. It's so difficult. I'm struggling with it. Yeah, sure it is. Watch, watch Colin play this game, and he'll never miss. Yeah. And uh, TJ discovered a move today. I'm hoping we can see the, the TJ shuffle that he uh, did. That works really well in this multi ball. Jimmy! Everybody say hi to Jimmy. Mode. Let's see, whatever we have. We haven't seen Storm in the Castle, right? Yeah, let's do Storm in the Castle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Is it start or yep. launch? Okay. Where's the buttercup? Shoot, Let me spray. No, there is too much. Let me sum up. Buttercup is Mary Humper Dink in a little less than half an hour. So all we have to do is get in, break up the wedding, steal the princess, the make our escape. <laughs> after I kill Count Rugen. It doesn't need much time for Dilly Danny. So in this mode, the characters are working to the right to get to the castle. So we have the scoop opening across the playfield, moving to the right. And he's got to shoot it, I believe, two or three times to get to the next phase where the candle is there. And then he lights the candle on fire, etc., etc. But he's got to keep progressing through with this hitting the moving scoop shot. But soon you will not be here. Thanks, no oh. survivors! Oh. Sorry, getting fast. I will never love again. Brad, nice to see you, buddy. All right, then. No more interruptions. All right, farm boy. <laughs> See this farm boy sequence. Farm boy. Farm boy one. Punish my horse to saddle. Where is this Ruger now? So I might kill him. No. 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 Oh, farm boy. Okay, so as you go through the farm boy sequence, you collect as you wish. As these are the multiple well, options in the battles. Nice you start off the game with one as you wish. So maybe Kevin will uh, be brave enough to try one. We'll see. <laughs> well, I died, so it's not gonna happen now. Well, we'll see. Right, let's get a let's get a four player game going. Let's do yeah, it. Do it. All right. Captain. I was from the Trisor. Do you want to pick it up? For uh, so long. Okay. I'll go for it. Yeah. Oh, we're choosing order now. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Let's see what the best player at Multimorphic can do. So the creative director in the game should be really good at it, yeah. right? Yeah. Theoretically. Because. Let's just stay for the fact. I stand for all the bad players out there. I'm the one that's trying to make the game simple. Set low expectations, right. Don't by any chance happen to have six oh, fingers dialed in on that. Captain Ball. Farm boy. Punish my horses. Farm boy. As you wish. So I saw MJ Ocean in chat. He is another software developer on the game. I saw Snailman. He is Colin McAlpine, the rules designer of the game. Oh, 
It stuck around. This is Come not on. as easy Quickly. as it looks. It's not as easy as it looks. It's not. <laughs> All right, Jerry, show what's up. Yeah. Sure. Big boss. Chapter one. But you don't by any chance happen to have six fingers on your right hand. Hi, Is that the hype train, y'all? Appreciate it. Saddle. As you wish. Thanks, Orbital. Alright, so I shot the left boot no shot to, to start a scream. mode. I'm going to select There Will Be Blood Tonight. That looks so good. You don't smell so good either. No, they really Perhaps should not no. let me play. I feel fine. <laughs> yeah. This guy said he's going to beat uh, Jerry, so it's going to be all good. No, it's just going to be really, really embarrassing when I eventually do accidentally beat Jerry. Which I always do. Always once. <laughs> Six hype train, you guys, you guys are crushing it. Thank you, appreciate the hype. All right, I need to shoot the spinner on the right to uh, where is this Rogan now? More wake up and go. It's with the pranks in the castle, but the castle gate is guarded by 30 men. I need Vecina to plan, I have no gift for strategy, but Vincent is dead. I have true love multi ball lit. Oh, I hit a side loop for inconceivable. I need Qualified pit of despair. What? He bested you with strength, your greatness. He bested me with steel. He must have outthought Vicini. And a man who can do that can plan my castle right, on the slot is any day. out. Failed. Now I want to start another mode, I think, before I start true love as well. Fred's hanging out here. He's, he's gonna be playing. <laughs> I played it briefly. <laughs> Alright, so this is the ball save mode. I, I drained the ball, but I had pitted a spare lit, so I have a chance to get my ball back. I have to hit all these shots without draining a single ball. Hardly hold all the time. There's a lot of hype. Can you do it? Can you do it? Don't miss it, Jerry. Can you do it? Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Bailing. Oh, I had it. Left for him. Left for him. Left for him. Jerry, no. <laughs> it says on the screen, my flippers are disabled, so I know when I'm hitting them that nothing's happening now. You are I'm, now all dead. It also I'm, says you are all dead. I'm apparently all dead. <laughs> is, is the only timer there the ball draining? Or is there also a... There is no timer. There's no timer. It's just the ball. Yeah, yeah. just the ball. That's a, if you drain a single ball, you're dead. You're all dead. How many shots is it? It was three or four. The bench is right. Three? Three. On the Buy easy one, if you come back strength. again, you can earn multiple... Uh, okay. Pit of Despairs. So if you come back a second time, you get the hard version where they take it to 50, level 50, so then you got to do more shots oh in the my. second time through. That is that is so not a gimme of a, a last chance mode. No, that is but hard. it's it's doable, right? Yeah. You can do it. it that's it's really been cool. done, but yeah. it, it, it's it's not impossible. It's, it's it's something that's a fun mode to play. Yeah, through. you drain yeah. the ball. You shouldn't get it. You should gimme, get, should gimme, get it back. Yeah. 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 Exactly, exactly. <laughs> you got to earn it. That's yeah. really cool. But... I think we can all agree. You it's not as easy cry. as it looks, is it, but Jerry? You <laughs> six fingers on your right hand. Uh, five times the score says it's a little easier than you made it. Okay, but you know, who cares about score? <laughs> I'm in it for the story. Yeah, you saw a little bit more of the story than I did, but. And there will be no one to hear you scream. Uh, somebody had a question earlier about how they can get this game in Canada. You can order it direct from Multimorphic.com. We yeah, work no with international freight brokers, and we can hook you up. 
Those are the shrieking there's eels. A, there's a link at the top of the chat if you don't for believe uh, me, the multimorphic site if you want to learn more. They always grow louder. Yeah, again, there are multiple versions of the of the game. Flesh. In all versions, the physical play field, the shot layout is identical, but we have different trim levels with different decorations. So you can order a standard edition machine, a limited edition with different artwork, or the collector's edition, which is what we're playing today, oh, no. that has the limited artwork in addition to cabinet mounted swords and special back glass, special bronze powder coated hardware, and uh, it, it's just a beautiful machine. If you already have a P3, you can order just the game. Certainly hope you find them someday. For a fraction of the price of buying a new traditional machine. We currently don't have a distributor for Australia. We do have one for New Zealand. So Ye Old Pinball Shop is uh, is hooking people up in New Zealand. And if you if you want to order direct, we can get one to Australia, or you can work through through Hamish at Ye Old Pinball Shop. Hamish is in chat. Welcome, Hamish. Nice to see you. You promise not to hurt him. I do not mean to pry, but you don't by any chance happen to have six fingers on your right hand. We've done there will we blood yet, so let's try that one. He's done look so good. <laughs> oh, did he? <laughs> okay. You don't smell so good either. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Perhaps not. I feel fine. <laughs> <laughs> you'll, you'll get there eventually. You have to, you have to earn it, though. All right, let's him up. So in most pinball games, you see movie clips, but they're on the back box, and while you're playing the game, you can't see them at all. You have to, ho hopefully the ball's held long enough for you to see the clip on the back box, but here we play the video clips right under the ball as you're playing, and it just pulls you into That's the enough. story. That's enough. You're playing this film. Where is this Rogan now? So I might kill him. And the shots you make are progressing the scenes of the film. The castle game. The Fire Swamp is the mini wizard mode dead. of the no. Gilder section, which is after the battle. So it. if somebody's really killing we it, we the hope to see the Fire Swamp tonight. The question about the six-fingered hand icons you see on the screen, those are shot markers for shots you need to hit to qualify. Prepare to die multiball. Failed the mobile, we got true love multi box. So let's go. This happens every day. Hopefully, you can get yourself a kiss to make you feel better. Kiss hype! Alright, Kevin. Let's get them kisses. Kisses? Kisses, kisses. You'll hype. release me. Right. Whatever you ask for right. ransom, you'll get right, I gotta do the TJ you. move here. Uh, Joe, it's the TJ move. Let's right. see. If Go I on. can get the ball, this ball on the right, I'll try it. Let's see. Let's see if we can't do it. All right, there you so, go. Aim for the center. And what is there? And then... Boom! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Inconceivable! <laughs> we call right that here. the incontigible. Oh! I missed it. I hit the post. Fail. It was worth it to do that setup, though. Yeah. Pro tip, when you have one ball locked at the kiss lock, you can actually stage a second ball behind it for a double super. What? Sure, now he tells me. I'm not exactly sure who that other, who, which character that second ball is supposed to represent. <laughs> but, um... Creative license. Yeah. Use, use your imagination. The swords in front of the castle, they activate every time the ball hits the captive Boom, ball. They're mechanically tied together. Oh. Nice job, Kevin. 
So there's a mechanical link between the captive ball and those swords, so they activate all the time. Just a cool mechanical and visual gimmick. So this one's all about alternating the green qualification shots with a red jackpot shot. And you've got to get six jackpots and then it goes to a uh, phase two, which is a six ball multi-ball. Oh no! I don't think anyone but Kevin died in that moment. Only Fezzik is strong enough to go up our way. I prepared to die. I'm just, you know, you gotta leave some things for the, the people at home to see on their own. That's, I'm, I'm doing everybody a favor. Looks like Kevin does have a Pit of Despair qualified. He got that from the Inconceivable Side Loop. So when he drains the ball, he will have a chance to save it. Look, he's right on top of us. Whoever he is, he's too late. So like we said, we can you can skip all these intros if you want, but I don't know. I've watched these a billion times and cutting these, and I never get tired of that intro. Yeah, I like that one too much. I could never cause you grief. He's climbing the rope, and he's getting on us. People are asking for a battle of wits, Kevin. I'm not smart enough for that. Did I make it clear oh, that your oh. job See? is at stake? <laughs> Not this time. Ah. All right, you can save it, though. You save it. Oh, that's right. The pit of despair. Don't even... All right, so Kevin aborted that introduction, got right back into gameplay. I mean, that didn't hurt my feelings at all. Oh! It, I, that's what I give her in your intro. <laughs> I know there's like six different intros for Pit of Despair. I'm all dead. Cool. You, you don't have to watch any of them. He's dead. This is not as easy as it looks. All right. All right, you're up, Steven. I know you guys. I'll make this quick. Oh, okay. So we always try to hit the center ramp right on launch because that's the skill shot sequence. If you do well on it, you collect more as you wish tokens so you can use them later in the game. And I timed out. Yep, now that that's timed out, he can shoot any of the uh, three shots to qualify and start a mode. Look, he's right on top of Starting us. with the cliffs. Whoever he is, he's too late. See? The cliffs of insanity! Hurry up! Move the thing! He's climbing the rope. He's well, thank you, us. Frank. The, the, we, we've been so excited to show a visual based property on this system for so long. This is, this is a perfect. A theme to implement in pinball generically, but also on the P3 because we can immerse you into that story with the screen. Just being able to watch the clips is is awesome. You keep using the horn. I don't think it means what you think it means. All right. All right. Time for the wits. Stellenberg. Do it. Cooper, many. Yeah. Morons. <laughs> so do it. Yes. As you wish. This is really dumb of me. <laughs> As you wish. Really dumb, we'll do it, but we're gonna do it. Well, you're using your wits. Peer to do this. All right. Where is the poison? The battle of wits has begun. It ends when you decide and we both drink and find out who is right and who is dead. As you Watch the ball roll down the center ramp. <laughs> Just like the characters roll down the hill in the movie. Oh, I drink the poison. 
Run away! Run away! Wow. Wow. <laughs> that was the most impressive s demonstration of, of wit. That was the worst ever. <laughs> we didn't even have time to explain the mode. Yeah, let me go back, see if I can't get back in there. So, if you do badly and ba battle wits, you drink the poison cup right away, you're gonna die. <laughs> He was just demonstrating how quickly you can drink the poison cup. But at least I got to show people rolling down the hill. That was nice. Yeah, we hadn't seen that yet. All right. I started to lose confidence. You have six fingers on your right hand. Someone was looking for you. That you have means... to build up the intolerance, the tolerance to the iocane powder uh, by playing the mode. Yes. So a more skillful player would have shown you that you are spelling iocane letters to build up your intolerance. Farm boy, fill these with um, water. You don't have to lie to me, digital Jedi. That was not a good game. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it was entertaining for all of us, the viewers at home, I'm sure. You killed my father. The clips, by the way, are playing on the lower screen and the upper screen, which you can see in the video. So. You can see them as you play the game, and everyone watching can see them on the upper screen behind you. My name is Daniel Montoya. Death can't stop true love. All you can do is delay it for a while. You killed my father. Prepare to die. Form a fruit spot, then. I want the thief's forest emptied before I wed. We got to fall solve before these machines ship, but uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Brad, okay. okay, give it a shot, Brad. For now, let's see. Farm boy, yes, farm boy, polish my horse's saddle. Where's this rogue now? So I might kill him. And yes, he will save me, that I know. So, Miracle Max is the mini wizard mode of the Florin section. So again, if one of us is really killing it, we'll probably get to see the Miracle Max mode. I love it's also thing. the um, the mystery award is the Miracle Max and Miracle and Miracle Max Ascent. So we'll be able to see that at some point tonight. What princess is really quite a winning creature? Marriage. I do not marry tonight. The best. This is literally the, uh, the clip in the mode I asked for immediately. When I walked in, I was like, you guys have a Maywitch mode, right? So I have to play it, 100%. Pretty much every major scene in this film is in the game. All right. So the goal of this, you want to sell marriage by pushing them a buttercup and Hunkerberdink apart by hitting their shots and moving them across the playfield. And if you beat this, there is a nice little, uh, ooh, an inconceivable loop. Nice. Hey, thanks for the raid. If we get to the end of this, if you beat this, there's a nice little, uh, Bonus to the end of the now. Oh no. Alright, it's fair. We're gonna see it happen. You know, just be cool and play perfectly and don't drain. You can do that. It's gonna be so hard to escape. This is the most stressful, I think, second chance of all time. In such a good way, he needs. Yeah, in the best way possible. No! <laughs> Humiliations galore. 
the, the uh, end of ball call-outs are, are really good on this. Yeah. Like I said, there's still um, some, some work to do. We've, we've, we're still uh, putting some more stuff in there and, and uh, at, doing some more graphics work and some other uh, and stuff like that. But uh, it's uh, pretty feature complete. When this game ships in the, in the summer, it will be 100% complete. Yeah. Imagine that. A game shipping complete. Yeah, it seems pretty rare for the pinball industry. I'm not sure why. <laughs> Yeah, it's a, it's not a gross, it's not the, there's the line anybody want to feed up. We've got um, Rhyme Time, which is the feature mode in, uh, oh. on the uh, floor and shot. So as you hit the floor and shot repeatedly, you will eventually start Rhyme Time, which is, uh, you as you keep in that shot, you'll be cycled through Fezzik's rhymes and, as he goes through and, and says his rhyme lines. What princess is really quite a winning creature? All right, let's throw him the castle. Stand your ground! Stand your ground! I'm the Twin Pirates! There will be It's always Ryan time. Ryan? No? Not yet. My men are here! I'm here! Oh, we're out of time. There we go. No survivor! Oh, yeah. All you walls, nightmares, I'm about to come to you. Oh, there we go. Alright, I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, no! Oh, I thought it was gonna bounce. Boo! <laughs> That's good, I like that. I think I had one left. Yeah. I think it's six total, okay. and then you gotta shoot the left ramp. To complete it, to enter the castle, basically. All right. Yeah. All All right. right. Steven. Oh, me. All right, guys. I hope you got 30 minutes to watch me play <laughs> and get through this. Yeah. Everybody, uh, kick it out. Y'all go take a nap because this is gonna take forever. Farm boy, mm. fill these with water. The other two areas would be lit right now, but um, Aha, well, you fool. <laughs> <laughs> yep. not a fool. You're the fool of game. You are. I made you game. <laughs> All right, no more interruptions. <laughs> Player two. All right, got Castle lit, got True Love lit. Can start working towards prepare to die. I've already beat Steven. Mission accomplished. Fill these with water. I love Wesley. I always so have. Plunge and walk off. Then. That's right. That's right. There's nothing better than a walk off. I do not mean to pry, but you don't by any chance happen to have six fingers on your right hand. So I already played this multi-ball once. The second time through to stage prepare to die, it's a little more difficult. My father was slaughtered by a six-fingered man. Buttercup snake. Everybody in chat, Mandra's tell Mandraz that his art is amazing. Because this, this art I package is just gorgeous. And there will be joy. I present to you your queen. Queen Buttercup. Two ball, multi ball, I have to survive it. And it's hard to survive because I have to survive 40 seconds with no hold on my flippers. I just have to flip and keep the ball in play. I'm not thinking this is true, no. Uh, 
And I just stacked True Love Multi Ball on top of it. This is how I completed the mode earlier. You know, no big deal. Let's see if Jerry can do it. Trying to kick balls out, it's struggling. It was ten days till the wedding. The king still lived, but Buttercup's nightmares were growing steadily worse. I'm good. Okay, I'm gonna reset this one. And everyone note, I have way more points than Steven. <laughs> uh, player four won that one, just for the record. Player four. Player four. Set it. We'll get it going again. You get to demonstrate the uh, launch launcher on the P3. So this is how you spot yes. between different games. So on the screen now, you see all the different applications that we have installed for the system. If we were to swap in different playfield modules, some of those other applications would be enabled, available. But for this particular playfield, the Princess Bride, only the Princess Bride app is available. Let the record show. There's no way we could tell who could would have won that game. It's impossible. <laughs> <laughs> With all the movie assets, uh, video assets, audio assets, it's a it's a large game. It takes a couple seconds to load, and now we're ready to go. Uh, so let's switch it up. TJ, you want to play? Yeah, we need TJ in. We need to see the incontigible. We'll just do a four-player game again. TJ will start us. Professor John, I've done it now. I haven't fought just one person for so long. Okay. Hi, Charlie. <laughs> But you don't by any chance happen to have six fingers on your right hand? Death cannot stop true love. All it can do is delay it for a while. So my father was slaughtered by a six fingers. Thank you all for joining us. This is, a, this is an awesome experience for us to show off this game, and uh, we certainly hope you're enjoying it. Pinball is such a physical experience. It's kind of it's kind of fun being able to combine that physicality with the with all of the dynamics of the virtual display. I've done nothing but study swordplay. It's neat how the shot markers, which are showing you what to shoot, they change. The, the different icons, different text, they dynamically change to show you what to shoot for. So right now he's got three icons lit, one on each Look, one on each area, and he's starting clips right now. Whoever he is, he's too I want to take late. a second to brag on uh, Roy Sunuda and the stuff that he's able to do in Unity on that screen and the, the, the light sweeps down the play field and these interactions that, that bring this uh, this game to life when you're when you're making these shots and, and uh, everything coming, uh, all this uh, feedback Did that I you're getting from these Did I make it clear that your job is at stake? Climbing the rope. And there's gaming on us. Yeah, one really cool thing we've done in this game is we've taken this map scene and we've overlaid lighting effects on it. So, so you'll see wipes, light wipes going up and down the screen or exploding from a spot or whatever. And, and it's, it's these really cool light shows that are shown just on top of graphics. I did that on purpose. I don't have to miss. I believe you. So what happens now? We face each other as God intended. Sportsman life. No tricks, no weapons. Skill again, skill along. So battle of strength because it's, a, it's, it's themed around a physical fight with rocks and boulders and wrestling. The, the shots are pretty much all targets. I don't even we don't really use the flow shots in this mode, just the targets and the captive ball. Quick. No. 
is a warning. Tilt warning. I don't believe this. Don't mind if I do. The Prince's Bride. So every ball starts, you're in the bedroom scene, the book opens up, and it drops you into this, uh, this fairy tale land. Farm boy, punish my horses. As you wish. The main theme we're hearing now, there's actually three variations of it that play with different instruments at various times. Fill these with water. I love Wesley. I always have. As you're making your way through the stories, um, you can choose to go into... There's a there's a lot that's close to the flipper button. You can go into any of the three regions and play any of these modes in any order that you want. But we do reward you if you go on narrative streaks, which is you go in the narrative order of the book. Um, if you want to, if you choose to do that, you do get bonuses for doing that. So you can start at any point and start going on a narrative streak. Uh, but you can also just peel off and go and pay, play whatever you want. Anyway. I'm here, but Ow. soon you will not be here. Yes. Pinball Mikey, there are interactions with the screen. They are just well disguised, and they show up when you least expect them. The Fire Swamp's a good example. The Fire Swamp uses the interactivity to, to do some pretty cool things. I would have had it right there. I do not mean to pry, but you don't. Pluto is up to bat. Chapter one. But you don't by any chance happen to have six fingers on your right hand? We're closed! Look, Trying to get back into battle he's right with the top of us. You know, Whoever he is, he's yeah, this, too um, late. What we did with the artwork in this game is we we completely covered all the, the ramp surfaces, every bit of the ramp surfaces with uh, decals this time. Uh, in Weird Al, we had the walls and stuff covered with uh, decals, but not the uh, not the uh, spring steel. He's climbing the rope, and he's getting on us. Oh, I did that to myself. This is not as easy as it looks. Not to be rude, but that was a total Steve move there. <laughs> oh, is that what it's called? Yeah. <laughs> Go pull it a Steve. Yeah, yeah you totally Steve pull a Steve, out. yeah. Chapter one. Oh, couldn't even get to the Battle of Wits. Has anyone completed a mode yet? Yeah, I completed the uh, the one you were trying to work on. Right? Yeah, there will be blood. So in the book right now on the screen, you can see the characters on the left side. That's tracking your progress towards the wizard mode. And every character has four circles. I need to fill those circles in by completing various modes. When I get four circles completed for each character and complete all of the mini wizard modes that we haven't even gotten to yet, then it will light the final mode for horses. Only Fezzik is strong enough to go up our way. Video, get right to it. And dream. Well done. I could not bear it if you died again. Not when I could save you. He's climbing the rope. Cliffs. And he's getting on us. Faster! He didn't fall? Inconceivable. <laughs> Try Battle of Steel, the one-handed play. Oh, here we go. So I actually find it you easier to take my right fellow. hand off. I hate to because I get confused if I leave you it You seem on. a decent fellow. I hate to die. Back in. So I'm controlling the left and the right flipper with my left hand. 
So, uh, my software engineer, Steve uh, Shoyer, came down here and he uh, introduced me to the strategy of pulling both hands over and playing with your right and left hand on one guy. Yeah. He's not into a, a steam immersion, I guess, huh? <laughs> He's into winning, is what he is, but, uh, yeah. The on screen is telling me... I'm not left-handed either. Switch to my right hand. You okay, must expect so me to attack the right. Capoeira. I find the table cancels out Capoeira. Unless the enemy has a study, he's a gripper. Which I have. Nailed it. You did it, Jerry. Woo. Kill me quickly. All right. I would Jerry's assume destroy. Start rocket ship window to nice like Parsons. yourself. However, since I can't have you following me, then. <clears throat> Please understand. Do you want to talk about how the, the mech works? The cliffs mech? <laughs> you know it's magnets. What a hurry we're in. Secret sauce. So I just completed a, a battle. Now there's a quick hurry up on the right target. Oh, so I got. Number day. Mighty duel. I'm going to try to go back to the cliffs and get to some other cliff modes. All right. Your way. Life is fair. Life is an old Small one, though. We're going to do it, though. I feel it. Okay. Need a hand cam. I think you're on the wrong side, Digital Day. <laughs> Talk to me later. DM me. I'll, I'll give you some links. <laughs> Farm boy. Punish my horse to saddle. Sword yeah, exactly. Yeah. Well, it, actually it is really neat. Yes, he and for all you that wondering, yes, you can totally slap save. You can totally do everything with these swords. We totally thought of that. Your doing way. Doing 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 it. It. Kevin has been slapping the heck out of my machine. Slapping those swords. Yeah. I certainly hope you find him someday. Oh, good. My way. Thank you, Z. Which one my way? Um, the CE has a couple different features from the Limited. Uh, the Limited and the CE both share the same art package. They share the same... Uh, that was a warning. Um, <laughs> they share the same topper, but the CE comes with uh, some additional uh, powder-coated armor, and it comes with uh, these uh, armor-mounted swords on the side, and it comes with a special printed uh, back glass frame around the monitor and a, a numbered plaque and a certificate of uh, authenticity, signed certificate of authenticity, and a couple other, oh, I think boy. there's a translate too. So there's a, it's a package, there's a list on the website that has the breakdown of all the differences. Multimorphic.com. nothing but study swordplay. So Cliff's Meg Ryan is everything Pinball Magic's Meg wanted to be but couldn't. That's right. Pinball Magic is an illusion. Then there will be no one to hear you scream. Uh... That's right. That doesn't look so good. Soup mode. Soup hype. Soup hype. Soup hype. Oh, God. Let... No soup. No soup. Guess I'm up to So, Weird Al, we made sandwiches. In Princess Bride, we serve soup. That's right. Soup and sandwiches. Okay. This is a P3 game, which means we have access to the feature menu where you can create profiles, you can save your game state, restore it later. So if you have this at home and want to get to the end and are having trouble in a single game, you can actually save your state and pick up from where you left off the next time you play.
Only Fezzik is strong enough to go up our way. Yeah, some of the, Quick of the main cabinet Somebody hardware changed between Devil. Prince Pride and Weird Al, except on the CE, the, the mounting hardware for the for the swords changed. That's why the CE is a special cabinet. But it's still the CE is still completely a P3. It's a, you buy the CE, you can still buy all the other modules, you can still use all the other software games. It operates just like a P3. You can do everything with a P3. Fill these with water. Or I'll call the brute squad. Your way! So, like I said, to address the is there this mode or is that mode, basically, if there's an iconic scene or an iconic call out in this that you can think of in this movie, it's in this game somewhere, in some form. I'll just say that because we've got all the assets. All of the assets, not just some of them. That was a warning, guys. Jerry trying to show up the tilt. Uh, <laughs> oh, there it is. I'm sorry, Nigo. <laughs> I didn't mean to jar him so hard. Do you want me to send you back to where you were? Thank you, Jerry. Unemployed in Greenland. Yep. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love that. Incredible. All right. No more interruptions. Yep. 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 Okay. What ball is this? Three. Three. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, you're not going to get a fireball. I thought you were going to make a way to the fireball. Somebody said the tilt bob really sensitive. <laughs> that's, that's what I've been saying the whole time. It's not sensitive at all. TJ's it's just stronger than the rest of us. That's true. I, 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 try, <laughs> I tried to save a center drain and failed. Oh, good. My way. Thank you, Nzidi. Which was my way? You don't have to climb it again, that's right. I hate to kill you. You seem decent. That would become tedious. So, yeah, we, we accelerate you to the top every subsequent time you get Thank to you. it. Okay, let's go. All right, well, I see lots of prancing, CJ, while you're battling. <laughs> there you go, yeah. Oh. <laughs> You're using Bonetti's defense against me, huh? Don't rush me, Sonny. I can tell you said you're a gripper. <laughs> I love that voice. Thank you, Cash on Far. <laughs> I, I, I appreciate that. We, we have a ton of love for this movie, and I like when people recognize that that shines through whenever we uh, put something out there. Pit of Despair is interesting because the whole concept is you're mostly dead and you're trying to recover. So we actually take away all your remaining tilt warnings. So y you cannot shake the machine in this mode. If you do, you're dead. You're all dead. And if you want to get out of it, you don't have any more tilt warnings after that. After that point. Just one more shot, no draining balls, and he'll get his ball back. It's so easy when there's no pressure. Yeah, we have a team full of huge fans of this film, including Steve Scheuer, who, if you actually Google Princess Bride Pinball, you'll come to his site where he was thinking about doing a, a custom game for the Princess Bride. We saw that. He's a friend of the company. We asked him to join the software team to develop this game. Yeah, time I had a question West about whether or not anyway. something 
I do was not clear, true to the game or whether or not it was, was we were being true to the source material, I'd always come to Steve, and Steve was a great resource throughout the entire process. Yeah, all dead is in quotes because all all dead sounds weird if it's if it's just said in a sentence. So the the quote in the movie is all dead. So we use the same words. Geez, how many times have I seen the movie? Uh, as many times as I've seen it, it's way fewer than everyone else in this development team because they they all had to get every detail perfect. Here comes my whistle now. Your marriage stacked with true love. And why is there fear behind your eyes? There's a, a really, a really cool integration if you complete marriage while in true love multiple. Form a proof for them. I want the thief's forest emptied before I wed. I love that. Every, Every time you here. complete the in lane and out lane, you get a bonus multiplier. System. The pit of despair. Looks. No, just kidding. They think we can read. <laughs> Wait, we're reading their text. Oh, whoops. I'm, I'm foiled. All dead. All dead. Ha -ha, you <laughs> fool! Yeah, can't, can't let him walk off. That's right. Oh, TJ's winning. What are you talking about? Oh, TJ's player four. No, I'm player four. TJ's player one. Oh, all right. Yeah. All right. Don't worry about me. Oh, I'll bring it up the rear. Don't worry. Looks like I'm one. Oh, <laughs> yes, yes, indeed. You are now. Oh boy, fill these with water. I was just talking about bonus multipliers, too. Brad's about to crush it and put us all to shame anyway. You had to jinx it uh -huh. like that? See? You had to jinx it like that? That's a classic bubble. <laughs> yeah. Man. Yeah. <laughs> Way to Steve it, Brad. I see you again. What are you, you're playing. All right. Like, you're doing right. really good. Yeah. Oh, Boom. thanks. Great. Thanks. Yeah. Raise the ball, save hands, too. All right. I have Gilder open, so I'm ready to send the ball to the cliffs. Back in my day, TV was books. Let's see if I can backhand it. Oh, yes, you're very clever. Now oh, shut up. Thank you, Lizzie. <laughs> Which was my way? Wits. I'll do strength first. Correct, yeah, you can't drain any ball in uh, Pit of Despair, but if you complete all the red shots, the first time around it's three shots. Uh, I you believe you. Back. Yeah. So what happens now? We face each other as God intended. Sportsman life. No tricks, no weapons. There are oh, left skill again, skill along. We can snag the ball, we can stop the ball on the on the oh. orbit, we can stop the ball on the I don't even the left ramp. Can... Are you just fiddling around with me? Didn't do it, Kevin. Fail. I'll never love Both again. ways on the orbit. <laughs> Please understand, I hold your highest respect. Look at this guy. That's me! Look at him. I didn't even win! <laughs> nice game, Gerald. What'd I get? What'd I get? I didn't Must have been a, like a mode mode. Uh, High score or something, right? Yeah, let me page through the high scores real quick. As you can see, we have, high, we have regular high scores, but we have a whole lot of categories to show you progress through other things. Battle of Wits scores. Most rhymes played if you start the rhyme time feature. There's high score categories for a lot of things, so everyone has a chance to get their name up somewhere. Fire Swamp, There Will Be Blood. A whole lot of categories. All right. All right, let's do another one. Here we go. By Esmo, Mr. Chapter One. Who's going first? Steven, Steven? you want to Steven? play? Sure. 
So I'm just gonna make a run all the way to Four White Horses real quick. All right, here we go. All right. Ball save. I just want to show off my pretty ball Will save animation. Not to hurt him. <laughs> yeah, there's a reflection of you in that ball. Hey, it came back. He wanted to show it off twice. Say it off twice. Yeah, there's still a reflection of you in that ball. See if I can get the uh, ball stopper to go. I think you're qualifying the center ramp feature right now. Can I get the, oh, there you go. So he just started no, really? uh, Promise of a Woman, which is a special mode that? on the You'll center ramp. If you just can keep, keep repeating that center ramp during this mode, you get a lot of points. This is not as easy like as that. it looks. Just like that. He got a lot of bonus points. I'll stick with player too. Yeah. Not even that many bonus points. Sorry. The Prince's Bride. Do we have pop bumpers or shaker motors? There are pop bumpers in some of our play fields. Again, this machine accepts modules, so each game is presented in a play field module. This is our eighth play field module, uh, but a game like Lexi Lightspeed or Weird Al's Museum of Natural Hilarity, they have traditional pop bumper layouts. Which, by the way, if you own the P3 machine, you can you can add Weird Al's. Museum of Natural oh, Hilarity to your game goodness. library for a Who fraction of the price of buying like? a traditional machine. See? You can see everything on our website at multimorphic.com. Yes, of course, drained in high stew too. Move the thing. Thank you, Bingo Podcast, Nick Baldridge, for amusement only games and author creator of a bunch Did of add on games for the P3, including insane. Drained, which is a a whole playfield module that, that Nick created and offers for the system. Which is right behind Kevin's shoulder over there. Come on, Cliffs. He's climbing the rope. And he's gaining on us. And shaker motor? No, we don't put a shaker motor in the cabinet. What we have is a really good woofer in the cabinet. And if you play real low frequency myself, sounds, you will feel that cabinet rumble. Especially in final resistance. With Denise music, for <laughs> sure. Inconceivable. <laughs> I don't think All right, I'll, I'll do battle the wits. Wits. Uh, no, we'll do it single ball. Yeah, I I'm afraid. Uh, shooting the poison cup right away. <laughs> Not gonna pull a Steven. All right. Yeah, don't, don't pull a Steve right away. Where's the Steven's poison? really good at demoing the strategy. Has begun. Yeah. It ends when you All decide right. and we both drink and find out who is right I was and who is dead. I intended to show you. I just wanted to show you what I did. So as you can imagine, this mode is about building up your immunity to Iocane before you drink from the goblet. So what Kevin did was he shot to your first shot, so you've got because he would know, a dangerous poison cup that I demonstrated earlier, because I'm, I'm there for you viewers, that the poison is dangerous cup over there now by the letters he's got to hit. So if he wants to get that cup away from those shots, he can hit the reverse shot up the middle to swap them. You've made your decision then? Kevin, shoot the ramp. Because I the ramp comes from Okay. See, now the goblet switches way far away from the the, the end that he needs. As you are not trusted by me, so I can clearly not choose the wine. Then make my choice. I will, and I choose. What in the world can that be? He's built up his leg. I don't see anything. No matter. Oh, it switched right before you did it. Me from my class, and you from yours. Oh. Drink from your cup. Drink, drink. Woo! Drink and time. Oh, give me the ball. Drink give me the ball. <laughs> oh. That was actually a really funny sequence because Kevin shot the correct shot right when Vicini switched to the goblets in the scene. So the goblet switched on the play field. So Vizzini foiled him. You don't by any chance happen to have six Clearly, I don't have enough hand. wits. Yeah. Dummy. Try being less dumb. All right, so he's got a couple of six fingered hands to shoot to qualify prepare to die multi ball, and he can start a mode on any of the three major shots. That's what I said. Then there will be no one to hear you scream. Don't look so good. Soup mode. Soup mode. 
I failed the super mode last time, so I gotta I gotta redeem myself. That's not it. So some people watch the streams of the P3 and think everything's virtual because you have a top-down camera and all you can see is the shapes of flippers and balls, but these are real flippers, real steel balls, bumpers, ramps, loops, all the stuff. This is this is all the good parts of pinball with a couple of really cool extra parts. Ah. I did not redeem myself on that mode. One of which is this screen that we can show all this stuff so dynamically. Quite a winning creature. This game isn't even a fan layout. It's got a side flipper shot. We've got uh, Weird Al has got a very different I call layout. This that's, final uh, word. Got the, the squeeze box combo shots. I mean, we've got you know, completely different designs across the board. Different models. So you can see that there's a wide variety of designs across the board. From, from uh, the a cool use of the screen here. This is a mode where you have no hold flippers and you're supposed to survive. So we put text right above the flippers telling the player they do not hold. So there should be no confusion when you start playing this mode as to why your flippers aren't working the same way they normally do. Almost got a double. <laughs> oh, that's it. Ah, oh, seven seconds left. Dang it. True Love multi balls qualified by hitting the letters nice on the side player. targets. Right. Did you see that slap save, everybody? I just did it. Looks like Kevin has pit of despair lit, so he'll have a chance to save his ball the next time he plays. Inconceivable loop. Excellent. That's for all my cross down fans in chat. Form a fruit squad then. I want the thief's forest emptied before <laughs> I wed. Everybody out. Started a feature on the right spinner, uh, Dread Pirate Roberts feature, so you'll get a bunch more points if you shoot the spinner right now. I want to do that. I like points. That time's out in, I think, 20 seconds total. Uh, that's not it. Oh, yeah. To the pit. To the pit. Kevin, how's it feel to play with the swords right there by your fingers? It feels amazing. It sits in the spot where, you know, there, there's nothing there anyways. Like, if you're playing a normal, uh, regular, boring old cabinet, uh, there would be cabinet. And now there's a sword. Same, same idea. Can we go all the way around? No. Nope. There we go. All right, you're set up. Yep, so he survived the pit of despair, his ball's back in play, and he has been deprived of any remaining tilt warnings. So if he wiggles the machine, he's all dead. Because I'm mostly dead. That's right. happens every day. And just like the movie, if you don't want to hear the, look at the kissing part, you can skip it. Brian, I don't think we have the camera set up to show the uh, the outside of the cabinet right now, but you can head over to multimorphic.com and check out the product pages for the P3 machines, and you can see all of the decorations on the images there. software dev kit if anybody's interested in making their own pinball machine game you can uh, download the dev kit and get started playing around and developing software games for this platform and you can target 
any one of our play fields, multiple play fields, or all the play fields. Just start making games and bring them to life. Alright, put, uh, put you back there. Oh! Don't bim it! Hurry up, Kevin. Oh! Oh no! Oh. Oh. That, that, that was like being being rejected a kiss. Ooh. No kisses for Kevin. <laughs> that was pretty good. Coming I'll to theaters that. this fall. No kisses for Kevin. Yeah. Don't tell your brother. <laughs> Come on, boy. Fill these with water. By Lucas Pepke. these features you get you get to hear a lot new a lot of new call outs from from buttercup the promise of a woman features on the center ramp tj show what happens if you hit the ramp like four more times you don't by any chance sorry i gotta squeeze in close to jerry to get close to this mic guys come on over steven This center ramp is pretty easy to shoot on this play field, and we do a lot of things with scoring and rules to make it not that interesting to shoot it too many times in a row, but we actually do something physical too, so if you shoot it too many times in a row, it will make you stop. What can I do? But not when the feature is lit. Now you can shoot it as many times as you want and rack up those points. points. TJ started earlier today and told us, I don't care about the rules, I just really like shooting the center ramp. So I want to do it over and over and over again. I don't care if there are no points there, I just want to shoot it. It's so smooth. Combo Chuck, thank you for your order. We will anxiously... Wait, getting you your machine. We'll be excited to hear hear from you about it. Look, he's right on top of us. Center ramp shot. He's climbing the rope. And he's <laughs> getting That's really. why you went for the cliffs. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Look at this guy. Did I make it clear that your job is at stake? But yeah. all you have to do in this entire mode is hit the center ramp. And <laughs> drama, ratty drama here. Okay. He didn't fall. Inconceivable. You keep using the horde. I don't think it means what you think it means. By the way, to start a mini wizard, all you have to do is attempt. Ooh, he's going as you wish. They're on a purpose. You have to attempt I the modes in each area. You don't have to complete them. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Actually, the, if you're gonna do as you wish, as you wish is uh, probably. Yeah. This one's not a bad one to do. It. It's, it's the, probably the. Oh, what do you feel? Doesn't matter. Start. Uh, you started it. Go through and, uh... Alright, DJ. Let's get some... Uh, no! no. We got another multiplier. Pit of despair. Pit of despair. Pit of despair. Oh, no, it's in. It's good. It's, it's okay. 
I barely did it. Yeah. Yeah. Right on time. Okay, now Big Josh, just don't, just don't <laughs> flub this. Now Josh is insulting us from over there in Chicago. I should have started started Gilder first. (laughs) As I told you, points don't matter. Small Town Pinball, that's actually incorrect. We completed our build queue for Weird Al and Final Resistance, and as of the launch of this game, we were shipping machines within a couple weeks. Now, of course... The queue is built up again, but we think we'll get through the ordered machines pretty quickly once production starts. So I would expect after the summer of this year, when production starts on this game, we're shipping new orders that come in today, probably about three months after that. Well, if anyone wants more time before we ship their machine, we're certainly happy to happy to hold onto a machine for somebody. But people should not be concerned. That'll be a long wait. We have greatly increased our production capabilities as we've matured as a company. That's right. Five thousand more square feet of space we just added this month, right, and uh, I don't need the center ramp. But this I'm is do this. just the, real quick. It's, it's, sorry, go ahead. The TJ move. Yeah. This yeah. is the incontigible. Let's see. Oh, oh. oh, you almost had it. Oh. Don't even, don't even need it. Oh, what is he? What is he? JT Gribble optical spinners are awesome. There's no friction on that spinner. We actually have to sometimes deal with so many spins that we have to reduce the, the, the noise, the sound effects that play when you hit them because they're, they're spinning so fast. And again, you don't have to complete these modes, you just have to start them in order to uh, unlock the wizard mode, the mini wizard mode. Fire swamp. All I have to do is divide from what I know of you. Are you the Not sort the of man who would put the poison into his own goblet for his enemies? Now, a clever man would put the poison into his own goblet because he would know that only a great fool. So, repeating the rules him. for this mode, you're supposed to collect the letters Iocane to, to basically become but immune to the poison. Fool. Nice save. So I can clearly not choose the wine in front of if you drink from the goblet before you have immunity, it will reset your progress. Or if you have no progress, it will fail the mode. Really? I, I wasn't aware of that. Then they can try I will, and I choose. What in the world can that be? Do you want to? All right, it's on the right no outer loop. First, let's drink. Me from my glass, and you from yours. Come on, no. you switched them. Uh-huh. Oh. I completed the mode. I didn't pass the mode, but I completed. All right. We got one more mode. Uh, that's a technicality. <laughs> it said fail. <laughs> All right. Chapter <clears throat> Sure, I'll play. I'll try for. I'll try for Fire Swamp too. Okay. See if. See if. <laughs> you like it. Okay. Bubble gum and tasting second. Holy physics is strong enough to go up our way. All right, we got we got two players going for Fire Swamp right now. <laughs> or Jerry, you could go for a different one. You can go for two to pain. I could never oh, that's true. I'll do that. Eric, Jerry's going for two to pain. Or you can go for Miracle Max. Which one? Two to pain. Two to pain. He's going for two to pain. Right. Two but to pain is cool. Don't chance happen to have six fingers. They're all cool, but... Thank you, Colin. That means a lot. Princess is really quite a winning creature. Okay, when, uh, Let me Colin's saying that when we do the fire swamp, we pivot the 
the uh, this camera down so we can show the the walls of scoops and stuff. Those scoops. So when you get there, I'll do that. Okay. When I get there? Yeah. Okay. Because you're gonna do it. All right. Yeah. No. Not yet. My men are here. Done nothing but study I'm here. But soon you will all right. not be here. I think I am. We're closed. That's okay. All right. Tonight we matter. I can hit all the ramps back and forth to qualify this thing. You never sent the ships. I kill a lot of people. So, if you bought the CE tonight, if we go into production in the summer, and it's just a matter of uh, where you are in the production queue. I'm not sure exactly how long that is right now. Jerry would know. But it, we don't have any estimate. I don't have any estimates right now. Inconceivable! Inconceivable! Double inconsistent. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Testing the tilt, Bob. Testing the tilt, Bob. <laughs> Marriage. <laughs> Marriage. Tilt check. Marriage is what brings us together today. today. Skip the end. Have you the way? Do you, Princess Bob? Boom! Bang on right. Got it. You won! You forced Buttercup to marry him, you monster. Good job, Jerry. You're the good guy in this. There's but one work in Castlegate. And it is guarded by 60 men. Oh yeah, I did notice the uh the tilt warning indicator on the the outline. That's awesome. Yeah. Castle mode. My brains, his go. steel, and your strength against 60 men. I want to give uh, Josh like all the credit. He's been like lining these call outs up and placing them around this game just in brilliant fashion. Two ball multi ball, no hold flippers. 45 seconds. Have to put the years unless my father's soul will be at peace. Uh, I don't think there's anything that we cut because we didn't have room for. We basically put in. I mean, we in the. I mean, obviously you can't put the entire movie in because there's not every scene is worth spending time on. But um, there's nothing we left out. And we're like, oh man, I wish we put that in there. Oh, I feel right at the end. Like I said, I challenge somebody to go through and try to think of an iconic scene or an iconic line that's in this movie and you you miss it and it's not there how about that yeah tear it up jerry oh look at he's got two of multi-ball going two of two of <laughs> that's attention to detail right? can somebody clip that sequence of jackpot <laughs> yeah <laughs> Oh, he can get the kissies! Get the kissies! Oh, I got the kissies! The kissies! Get the kissies! Get those kissies! Get those kissies! <laughs> All right, we. I have a castle. I can hit qualify with three shots, and I prepare to die also at the castle. So I will play prepare to die first. So you guys will notice that the letters on the side of the machine now spell out Twu Wove. So as you progress in the game from here on out, it, it's that uh, you are spelling Twu Wove from this point on in the game. I'll let this intro play. Hello. Manu, you, if you fly to Austin right now, you can get some you cuddles, I'm sure. Um, I mean, you can have cuddles and high fives. And Jerry will probably let you play it a little bit. You don't believe me? Just wait. All 
I gotta hit some green jackpots or some green qualifier shots, and then it'll light jackpot at the captain ball. Yeah, that's the way this this mode works. Is that you you basically have the setup shots, which is uh, where you hit the setup shot, and then the the captain ball is lit for the jackpot. And you can you can choose to keep juicing the jackpot. You can you can choose to keep going, uh, or you can cash in your jackpot during phase one, right? Such risk reward. But now I can try. But you don't by any chance happen to have six fingers in my hand? My father was slaughtered by a six fingered man. All right, to the pain. I like to get some momentum from the center ramp. And then try to hit the left rim. My Wesley will save me. There it is. There's a shortage of perfect breasts in this world. It would be a pity to damage yours. <laughs> there we go. Did you say I do? To the pain. Oh, no. Sort of skipped that part. Then you're not married. If you didn't say it, you didn't do it. Wouldn't you agree, Your Highness? A technicality that will shortly be remedied. But first things first. To the death. No. To the pain. All right, so now the flippers are actually weak right now. I, they're not strong enough to hit any shots. So that you'll be sure to understand. I'm trying, but I can't. So I have to hit the side targets to increase my strength. The first time in my life a man has dared yep. But what you can do with this? The right one was so weak. I'm sure you've discovered that I flubbed it. Oh, I flubbed it. I'm writing the definitive oh, words. Oh, man. So I want you to be totally conscious. So you got to hit the side targets in that mode to increase your strength, and then you have an opportunity to shoot the. But one one cool thing about to the pain is that you can um you with the weak flippers like that you can actually lob the ball up to the upper flippers and make your shots with the upper flippers from the lower flippers. It's kind of a cool uh, feature to do those lob shots. Oh, and you biffed it. I guess hey Jerry. Not bad. Thank you for showing us today. In, in total, <laughs> total, so you completely steved it once you got there, but Three that's all right. <laughs> that's right. It's for you to discover at home. Uh, Steve was one, right? Oh, okay. The player one has 42,000 points, so it's probably Steve. Oh, shoot. Steve. No, I didn't play, did I? Or was it? Yeah, I was. I was. That's right. I was unmemorable. <laughs> I wasn't talking a bunch of crap. So you can go back to, to the pain if you survive on Farm boy. Yeah, because I've played all three of the qualifying modes, the mini wizard will stay lit until I complete it. you wish. That's cool. My father was slaughtered by a six finger. <laughs> John, thanks for noticing that there are a bunch of little cool features in the river. You'll 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 see yeah, some other things pop up right periodically too. Someone was looking for you. So if I want to go for to the try to for to the pain, what should I do? Castle, Le Castle left left, pain, left rear. Max is the wizard mode on um on the Florin shot. That's okay. the left orbit. All right. I was like prepared to die over there. My name is Inigo Montoya. <laughs> you killed my father. Prepare to die. The water movement looks amazing. <laughs> it just gives a little character to this this otherwise uh, the static map scene. It's not very static right now with swords flashing. You've hit all the other jackpots? Ah! I think so. 
Yep, the only one left is the uh, the right side loop. I get, I get this all the time. So you stage all that by shooting the right outer loop, and it'll feed the the upper left flipper. Just got to get the ball on the left. Or you can hit a soft shot up the left ramp, and it'll feed right back down to the left flipper. That's right. Like that. Oh, okay. You had you had the uh, captive ball lit, so now you oh, can now you can stage more more jackpots. Ah. Your way. Kevin is a slap save beast, and the swords don't even get in the way of it. Finally, slap saves all day. All right, we'll do wits again. Wits. Uh, no. All right. Where is the poison? Then they come us. I will, and I choose. What in the world can that be? What? What? You guessed wrong. There you go. That picked up where I left off because I had played it early. Yeah, good point. We saved the status. The progress you make as you go through these modes, so if you have difficulty getting through it the first time, hopefully you hit a couple shots and it starts from there the next time. slightly less well-known is this! Never go in against a Sicilian when death is on the line! Yes! The right targets, Kevin, for a hurry-up. Nice. Boom. I okay. I bet my life on it. I got Dreadfire Robbers going too. No! Oh. Do you want me to send you back to where you were? Unemployed in Greenland? Okay, I think I've got one more Gilder mode. Oh, that's a million. Oh, nice. Yeah, Shut up, Yeah, you yeah, got yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's your last one, right? TJ's on the hunt for the fire swamp. Fire swamp pipe. Where's this organ now? So I might kill him. Yeah, that's smart. The geometry of this game is laid out so that you can backhand the cliffs from the right side, and you can backhand the left loop from the left flipper. You can also quit the. You can quit out of it. You hold both flippers and it'll exit the mode selection without selecting a mode, so now you can go to the cliffs. Oh, that's good. Have you ever heard of Plato? Oh. Yeah. That'll be ready for you next time you start a ball. Manu, I didn't get to talk to Rob Reiner. Should I go back to, to the pain again? Unfortunately, oh. yes. I wish I did. I did get to talk to Carrie, though. That's pretty sweet. Yeah. Farm boy, polish my horse's saddle. I love these, these Not only can ways. you have fun storming the castle, but it's mandatory. Let's try again. Crushing it. But first things first. All right. To the death. No. To the pain. Don't Steve it. <laughs> that, was a, that was the short version of the intro. I'm familiar with that phrase. Unexplained. For some and I'll use small well, words. So Even the short upper flippers are weak. You warthog-faced buffoon. Get that strength. Maybe uh, the first time. Oh, he fell. We're blaming Josh for that low <laughs> ball save. Yeah. Hashtag blame Josh. I already saw he said he was going to increase the ball save. You got Kuglerd. I mean, we could blame me for sucking, but... <laughs> to, to the drain. Oh! Oh, good one. You just got wrecked. <laughs> Who is this next 1X person? Uh, oh, me? Yeah, Steve. Speaking of to the drain, it's Steve's turn. Beat it! 
or I'll call the brute squad. Then there will be no one to hear you scream. Do you know what that's? I know what that sound is. It's the shrieking eels. Come on. Target three times. We're gonna find out. Oh, good. My way. Thank you, Vince. Whoa! Till Bob works. Yeah. <laughs> so this is uh, creative framing. He's uh, Kevin's going for a Dutch angle here, as we called it in the 90s. <laughs> Because the sponge is giving us some trouble. I want. Kevin's not happy. He wants to go somewhere else. Oh, good. My way. Thank you, Vinzini. Which was my way? All right, here it's we go. Tim Lee! Hi, Tim Lee. We're gonna multi ball it. You see my distant fellow. <laughs> I hate to kill him. Left-handed sword. I'm gonna try the cheater. To cheater, two hands yeah, on the try left side. Cheater. Try the cheater, pumpkin eater. See if you can do it. I don't know how, if this is much easier. <laughs> You're using Bonetti's defense against me, huh? Considering the rocky terrain. How is hockey, Ow. Tim? Boom. <laughs> That's the trick. You gotta get back. Spot I want Whoa. the thief's forest emptied before I went. Justin, which Applebee's are you at? That's the important question. Are you at the one a mile left or a mile right? All right. Yeah. I'm okay. Two-handed swordsman. When, when you get there, I will move it. <laughs> yeah. All right. No more interruption. Oh, no, wait. Did I, oh, I didn't do Battle of Steel yet. Never mind. Hang on. He's going to do it. Let me get to, let me get to the Battle of Steel. I'm going to do it. Oh, you see all my lighting that I didn't, I didn't consider the... Uh, <laughs> This framing when I set up my lighting, guys. I'm sorry. Have you ever heard of Plato, Aristotle, Socrates? All right. TJ's not going to biff it. Don't Steve it. Okay, here we go. See if he gets through it. Want to see that dancing, TJ? I'm not worried about dancing, Steve. Put your hips into it. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. Oh, we were so close. We we're almost there. Jerry. All right, no more interrupt. Fire swamp depends on you, Jerry. Fire swamp, I'm doing to the pain again. Oh. I, I, to, I, the I, I, <laughs> to the drain. To the drain. Zero progress to Gilder. Farm boy, punish my horse to saddle. So we succeeded in not spoiling Fire Swamp for people. Wait, I gotta find it. 
certainly hope you find him someday. Oh, did I, did I move the game? <laughs> I just gave it a little... A little nudge. Well, a little bump. Then there will be no one to hear you scream. Let's skip this. Hold both flippers to exit. That was a warning, Highness. Speaking of tilt warnings. Tilt warnings! Uh-oh. That's enough! Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, Leo. I didn't mean to jar him so hard. Well spoken, sir. Ah, oh, Jerry. Oh, man, he wouldn't be... <laughs> you hate to see it. You really hate to see it. Player so three. Much, huh? Player three. That's incontigible. Any last minute questions in chat? Who do you want to play us out? This is the final game of the night. It'll be, it'll be a real quick game. It's done by nine. <laughs> Six letters. Oh, look at this guy. That'll stand up. There you go. DJ. Oh, weird. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's Pluto. He's going to play us out. Uh, hope you had fun tonight. Uh, the, the guys will be answering questions during the last game, but uh, it's been a blast. And again, multimorphic.com. You can see all the product information. You can see all the trim levels. We have machines for new new to P3 customers, and we have play fields available if you already have a P3. I don't mean to pry, but you don't by any chance happen to... Fire Swamp does use ball tracking. Can you play the on, can you play online with other multimorphic games? So there are, there's Cosmic Kart Racing, there's Heads Up, and there's some other networking features in other games. But Cosmic Kart Racing is the most uh, commonly used one for head-to-head -head gameplay, where you can literally log onto the internet and connect to somebody else on their P3 and race against each other. We also have Twitch Connect, which is a very fun feature where if you're a streamer and you want your audience to interact directly with your machine, your audience can manipulate your machine in real time and uh, and cause all sorts of wackiness to happen to your machine and cause your machine to make noises and they can redeem bits to cause inverted flippers, reverse flippers, things like that in real time. I believe this. I think I hit that center target like a dozen times. That was rough. <laughs> All these weird comments from people are them trying to activate Twitch Connect features. <laughs> from other games. <laughs> from other games. <laughs> we have to set up the machine to enable it, so currently we have it disabled because we are just streaming this amazing new game. And we don't trust you guys in chat. <laughs> I trust each and every one of you. It's Kevin. He's, he's a very distrustful person. I am. Well, it's come from years of streaming. I know I know what happens. Did I make it clear that your yeah. job is at stake? And if you've got a P3 at home and you don't even have a Twitch account, you're not a streamer, you can still set up Twitch Connect and you can just mess with your kids by quit logging on to your phone and making your flippers do weird stuff. <laughs> Which I wouldn't know anything about that. I just know my kids freak out when their flippers are all of a sudden backwards. I gotta try this. I gotta try the battle. All right, here we go. All right. I would rather not do it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Probably smart. I suggest removing your right hand from the machine so you don't forget. And they're like, it's not working. Practice, practice right now. All right. You're using Bonetti's defense against me. Right button. There you go. Oh, all right. You get it. By the way, we have oh. we have this feature in all of our games called one-handed play. So if you if you're if you have trouble using one of your arms, you can set it up and always play this way. I thought of fitting, considering the rocky terrain. Uh, so what do I need, the catch ball? No. Uh, left hand. Left hand. Nice pass. Oh, come on. 
on. <laughs> Want to switch hands? Oh, no, what a hurry much. we're in. What a slap save. Nice. nice. Well, that was a, wait, that was a one-handed oh, slap save from the left side <laughs> for a right side <laughs> slap. Ah, time expired. Back to two-handed play. Go away! Nah, that mode's pretty good on time. You just have to hit the shots and not keep missing them over and over and over and over again like Brad just did. Thank you, Vincini. This is just be better. <laughs> play better. Play better. You're a good pinball boy, Brad. Don't worry about it. Don't let these guys tell you otherwise. Oh, good. My way. Thank you, Vincini. Which one's my way? So you just have to attempt each one to get the fire song. That's right. all I'm yeah. going for. I'm trying. I'm trying. Do it. Nice. Show us all how it's done. Oh, true. If you want to try this one as a multi ball, it's all drop targets, right? I don't have to miss. <laughs> Ooh. That's yes. a good way to challenge yourself and get through a mode quickly. So this is the mode to try as you're wishing. Oh, is it over? Yeah, the real danger. Yep. So you can qualify the cliffs again real quick. Yeah, that's smart. Nice. Have you ever heard of Plato, Aristotle, Socrates? Hey, uh, so thanks for the uh, the Twitch Prime sub. Uh, if you guys enjoy the stream, you got a Prime sub laying around, you want to share it with us, we'd really appreciate it. Thanks. All right, it's so ball three time. Ball three, one more cliffs mode, then you get to fire right. swamp. No more interruptions. Cliffs are wide open. I love it. Just gotta hit it. Just gotta execute. I promise, no harm will come to you. Nice. Have you ever heard of Plato, Aristotle, Socrates? Or... Simple. All I have to do is divine from what I know of you. Are you the sort of man who will put the poison into his own goblet? Thank you for the prime sub. Now, a clever sure, man would put the poison I mean, into his own seconds. goblet. So because he would know really that only a great fool yeah. would reach for what <laughs> no. he would No, play the mode. Play the mode. Play the mode. Play the mode. But you must have known oh, I was so just drinking. You would have counted on it, so I can clearly not choose the wine in front of me. It's right now, it's the right loop. Not remotely. Because Tyler King comes from Australia, as everyone knows. And Australia is entirely because of crypto. Perfect. You you intentionally <laughs> failed. <laughs> yes. Okay, now you gotta get through the cliffs again. You okay. steved it. Good job. Oh no. Oh, it's dead. Okay. I think the backhand. Yeah, the backhand is safer. You must have seen us closing in. That was a warning, Alex. Worth it. Worth it. Chill, <laughs> chill, chill, it. chill. Oh. 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 <laughs> it's two shots away. Oh. Two shots away. <laughs> all right, y'all. It's been a good stream. Appreciate all the all the hype train tonight, and, and uh, to Jerry and the team for having me out. Uh, we'll let them sign it off. Thank you all for joining us. We hope you enjoy the game. We've had a blast making it. We always have a blast playing it, talking about it. Um, check it out, multimorphic.com. The Princess Bride on the P3.